Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. My name's Anna and I do all things plus size fashion, beauty, and mom lifestyle. If any of that interests you, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. So I went to Walmart and went a little bit crazy. Um, there was some great summer pieces that I was super excited about. So yeah, we have we have a Walmart haul. I didn't even mention that. So we're doing a what I got at Walmart video. Um, I really mainly went in to get some swimsuits, but a lot of their like extra large and 2XLs were sold out in almost everything. So I was able to find one, but I've been doing a lot of swimsuit hauls lately. So let's get some clothes, you know, in the mix. So I'm really excited. I've not tried this stuff on and usually for Walmart videos, I don't sit down and show you guys this stuff first, but I am going to do that today just because I feel like um, it is kind of a bear haul and it's kind of nice to see it first, what it looks like and then see it on a body. I don't know. I don't know. For reference, I am five foot two. I typically wear a size 16 in pants um, from Walmart. I basically get I don't know, I'm such a variety of sizes at Walmart. Like, is anyone like that with Walmart? I will put my measurements down below though so you guys can see those since a lot of the stuff is just gonna be like whatever size I kind of was feeling. I will link all of this stuff down below as long as it is on the site. Sometimes um, things aren't always there, but usually they are. So just all this stuff should be there. I need to stop talking. This intro is getting a little bit long. So um, let's get to this fun Walmart stuff. The first thing that we actually have is a sweatsuit that I actually wore today to go get my nails done. Um, It was upstairs and I was like, this actually looks really good to put on. So I will show you guys that um right now when I stand up. But it was on sale for $15. They had a ton of colors and it was from the Terra and Sky um, brand at Walmart, which I believe is their like plus size section. So yeah, and I got it in a size one X, but I'll show you guys that real quick. Okay. So this is the lounge set I was talking about. And you guys, this is so loungy. Like it's just the most comfortable kind of lounge set ever. And these pants, I mean, this is like, they could literally fully, you can wear them as a romper almost. So these are loungy and just super, super soft, comfortable material. I did wear these out in grocery shopping, but you know, just keep that in mind. And it also just came with um, this nice, comfy sweatshirt, which honestly, I'm probably going to be wearing this sweatshirt literally all the time, throwing it over basically everything because it's a really nice, thin material. It's not like the... Um, standard kind of sweatshirt I guess but um yeah if you guys can see it's just like a really nice um thin sweatshirt but I do not think this is my slipper just came off I do not think this outfit is going to be on the site just because it was only $15 for both of them and it was on sale but I will look and um we'll see but there is no pockets which is very frustrating because pants this slouchy should have pockets and also um they're joggers but slouchy all the way to the bottom. Okay, and the next set that I got is this bad boy sleep set. And this literally looks absolutely incredible. So it's kind of a crop tee, but I don't really think it's going to be too cropped. And it came with a pair of shorts. And I did get this in a size 2X just because I felt like this would be really cute, kind of oversized, tucked in, lounging around the house, you know, those kind of vibes. But we'll see when I put it on because you never really know. Um, and this is from the Secret Treasures section. So this is like a night um, wear outfit, but you can 100% wear this out. So uh, yeah, let's put this guy on. I hope it... I hope I love it. I really do. Okay, so here's that two-piece set, and I am really glad that I got a 2X or extra extra large, um, just because the bottoms fit really nice, and with this kind of short, you def I do not want them any tighter, but this top is so, so cute. Like, I would wear this out. I just love the fit. I like the bigger neckline, <laughs> the um, where the arms sit. It's just really, really cute. I like the little pocket or that's not even a pocket why did does it look like a pocket on camera i don't know anyway <laughs> really really cute and for the price it's just like a perfect 
comfortable lounge around but you can also go out and run errands in this um the bottom is a little see-through so you can kind of see through it so just keep that in mind um you might be able to see through it in the back too but yeah so a really cute set it does come as a set so you can't buy the pieces separately but yeah they had a a ton of these in a bunch of different colors which is really nice too so the next thing that i picked up is this bodysuit from the no boundary section which is their junior section um and this bodysuit honestly just looked so good they had this in white i think it was only in white and black but i could be mistaken because they usually have things in a lot of colors but i just loved the buttons i love just it's just a really cute staple um, black bodysuit and I got this one in a extra large and this was only $7.96 which is such a steal for a bodysuit. I wanted to get the white one too but honestly um, I just have so many like plain bodysuits and yes I wear them all the time but it was like something in me was like you don't need it. So yeah I picked this one up. I think this is going to be absolutely perfect for summer with jewelry. Dress it up, dress it down, whatever you want to do and then I'm going to be pairing this in the try-on with... Um, this pair of shorts and these are also from the no boundaries section and it is just this black distressed pair of mom shorts but honestly these have stretch and I don't think I realized these have a ton of stretch I'm fucked I'm really excited and again I got something in my what anyway if I'm blinking a lot it's because there's something in there but these actually feel absolutely amazing so they look like mom um shorts but they're actually really stretchy and comfortable and I got these in a size 19. Okay so now onto the next outfit and the star of this outfit is this bodysuit it is so so cute I'm literally like I'm just obsessed and you can wear a normal bra because um it just kind of like <laughs> You can't really see it, which is really nice, um, which is why I got the black one instead of the white one. Um, and it is clasped, right? Clasped right now. So I just stepped into it like I was putting on like a swimming suit and it's perfect. So definitely the good size. Um, that's the back. So I kind of have like the tag all wonky, but really, really cute. And now onto the shorts. Ugh. They're good for the price, debt for $12 shorts, like, you can't really beat them. My butt is in 100% hanging out, but, you know, it, it, it's almost there. Um, I think I just got a pair of these kind of similar from Fashion Nova. They weren't black, but they were um, a kind of similar fitting short, and I just like those so much more. So, they're good. They're so comfortable, literally so comfortable, um, but just not my favorite shorts ever. I don't, I don't know. I'm just not head over heels for them, I guess, compared to other shorts I've gotten this season so far, but it is like a really cute, um, all black kind of outfit with some sandals or some sneakers. Um, and you can just throw on like a really chunky oversized cardigan or something like that. So that is this look. So the next thing, and I think this might be the final thing. No, no, I got a few other things from the no boundary section, but I got this shirt and it's honestly just like a really basic kind of plain throw on baby doll s shirt. It is wrinkly um, because it was in a bag, but I got this one in a extra, extra large. So a three XL and, um, this was at $9.96. So the reason I got this size is because I, I always get really nervous with these arms that they're going to be like too tight and I do not want to be uncomfortable. So yeah, I picked this one up, but I also think that these shirts look really cute with like, you know, a little bit oversizingness. I don't know, but, um, all right, let's put this one on and I'm hoping that it's cute and it's not a major flop. Okay, so I am so, so beyond glad that I got a 3X in this because it is still a little bit snug on the arms. So I don't know, not my favorite top ever. And I do kind of wish the, um, the baby doll style like flare out was just a little bit lower because it's kind of sitting on my back a little bit weird that it's like when I move it kind of like, I don't know, I'm just not 100% obsessed it is a cute shirt I again I just like I'm not I'm not really there with it I love the color of it but I don't know and I just I don't I feel like it's a little bit off like it's it's just not really my size um and I don't believe they go up to any bigger but yeah I don't I don't know their no boundary section is so weird like how the stuff fits because uh, 
I don't know. I'm just, I'm not really sure, but it is cute. Just, I don't know. I'm not obsessed. I'm just not. And then I got this shirt. This is also from the No Boundaries section. They had this shirt in a ton of colors and it is very, very basic, but what really sold me on it is this really cute little shoulder cutout detailing. I don't know what it is about it, but I was kind of like, yeah, that's cute. So this is another one. I had no idea what size to get because I didn't know if I wanted it to fit more of a shirt that you tuck into jeans, so a little bit tighter, or if I wanted it to be like a really loose, um, slouchy shirt that you wear with leggings or something like that. So I did get a 2X and I definitely do not think it's going to be a slouchy fit. This looks kind of like an in-between do you know what I'm saying? And I decided to get this pink color because it's just like such an um, spring, you know, I'm trying to incorporate, as you can tell by my fingernails, some of those bright spring colors. So um, I don't know, I just thought this would be really cute. And this was only $9.96. So such a steal, but um, let's see. Okay, so this shirt I actually really, really, really like. I like it, I think a lot more than I was expecting because it's so basic. The tag's kind of like hit me right in the armpit but it's so basic it's i'm wearing it with sweatpants but i think it'd be so cute with leggings it'd just be a casual look that you kind of just take to the next step so when you wear jewelry with it just really cute and they had this again in a ton of colors i think they had it in if they had it in black that'd be like a total moment because i would wear it a lot and it's so so affordable so the back is just plain but yeah you know, I like when you don't really know if you're going to absolutely be sold on something and you try it on and you're like, that's cute. That's really cute. And in their no boundaries section, they also had these just like fitted um, plain tank tops. And I want to say these were like $2. Um, I don't even see a tag that says the price, but I want to say the whole table is like $2 or something. And I just got this green one. It's honestly just like this super stretchy ribbed material and honestly I'm not really crazy about it because as you can see in like the past five videos I feel like I've always just been wearing these plain um like single strap tank tops that are just really comfortable this one's from Amazon by the way if you're wondering it's obsessed and I will have an Amazon favorites video coming at you very soon so stay tuned for that but um I just really like this green color I thought it was really cute I'm really not sure if I'm gonna like the way this fits but I thought we'd just um, try it out and it was only two bucks. So, and I got this one in an extra large just cause I definitely wanted it to be more of a snug fit that you tuck in some shorts to. And with that top or that, um, yeah, that tank top in the try on portion, I'm going to be styling it with this skirt. Now this is so, so out of my comfort zone. Like I would have looked at this three years ago and been like, that is so ugly. <laughs> um, I definitely would not have, search for it but I feel like I've been seeing a lot of people wear this kind of skirt and it's actually been really cute but you I don't know you guys we're gonna try it on it was a little bit pricey for Walmart this was $18.86 so it is the Lee brand so that's probably why but I got this in a size 16 and it's just like a khaki skirt um it doesn't look super super short but it does have like an elastic band here so I thought that would be kind of I don't know. I see people do it and I want to do it, but we'll see. We'll do it together. <laughs> if it's not it, it's not it. But also if you guys have had these and have styled them a certain way, like definitely let me know in the comments so I can um, figure out what I want to do. But yeah, so I'm going to uh, style those things together right now. Okay, you guys, I'm going to be completely honest right now. Um, first of all, yes, the skirt is too tight. So, but you know, I think I would have liked it if I'm literally sticking to this. Um, if it didn't have shorts attached because it has low rise shorts attached. So you literally cannot make this any higher than it is. So I even like, I'm like even tugging it a little and you can see that this is like not good. Um, which is so sad because I honestly think this outfit with like a higher waisted one of these skirts that fit right that wasn't like <laughs> super tight that would have been so cute this is so comfortable but no this is just so bizarre and I was like oh wait there's shorts in it this might be a total move but it's not um I just really want to take this off 
I'm not feeling myself. I'm not feeling my best. But this tank top is really cute. Again, just a plain tank top. Um, not really much to say, but I want to get this outfit off. Okay, so the next thing is another shirt that I probably would have looked at again like a year or two years ago and would have just never, ever gotten it. And even... I, like honestly I probably would have even looked at it a few weeks ago and it just would not have come home with me but I did see a blogger that I follow and she posted this shirt and she looked so cute she said it was a free people dupe um which I didn't really know that until she said that because I'm not really a free people shopper but um she posted this and this shirt was so affordable I want to say it was 13 $13.98 and this is also from the Terra and Sky section so this is their plus size section and I got this in a size did I already say a 1x but honestly now that I'm looking at it I think this is so adorable I'm obsessed with these huge flowy sleeves I love the square neckline and I know that it's definitely a statement piece so I 100% get that but I just saw it and I thought it was so stinking cute and it's so not me. It's so different, but also it matches my nails exactly. Okay, I didn't do that on purpose, but this might be an Easter moment too. Like how stinking cute. So yeah, maybe um, <laughs> hopefully like we can feel the moment together when it's on and hopefully it's not a total bust. But um, I'm excited about that. And with that, I'm going to be pairing this pair of straight leg jeans and these are from the T time and true brand so i think this is the only thing i got from the time and true brand maybe or maybe one other thing but i saw these and they're not a high rise so they're a mid rise but i loved them they're just a plain straight leg kind of worried they might fit more like a skinny jean though so i don't really know um and they have a nice bit of stretch, but they also feel extremely sturdy. So these were, do they have the price on here somewhere? I want to say these were like $16, $17. I can't find the price, but really, really affordable. So these are good straight leg non-rip jeans. It might be like a total win for us, but if they're too skinny, I don't know. We'll see. I never know until I put jeans on, but yeah, so got these. I just, I love them. They're so cute. Okay, so... I do think this shirt has potential, but I would definitely size down in this. Um, it just is a little bit too oversized, which I do like um, a good oversized shirt, but it feels like it's like gonna kind of fall off of my shoulders when I'm kind of doing things. But it is so, so adorable, like such a cute little Easter moment um, and definitely out of my comfort zone. But I kind of love it but yeah I, I think um I might have to exchange it for a size down because it's definitely it's definitely just a little just a little bit too oversized but really really cute and this is the back okay so now on to the jeans and the way they fit the bottom is so cute so they're not um, they're definitely straight so they do fit like skinny jeans on my thighs but then they flare out just a bit where you could fold them and they would give that kind of like mom jean-esque vibe but they're just too low rise for me I just I can't I can't do where they sit it's just it just needs another inch and it did say mid-rise so it has nothing to do with the pants I just couldn't find a straight high-rise pant they only were having like um high-rise skinny jeans which I just really didn't need so yeah just not absolutely obsessed with where they sit but they are a cute jean so that is the back of them I do really like them I'm just not not a hundred percent sold so the next thing I picked up is the one and only swimsuit this is such a big Walmart haul oh my gosh this is like the biggest one I've ever done which is actually like really nostalgic because my first video ever um, was a Walmart haul and it's almost been, I think it's been like 11 months since I started YouTube. So it just seems so crazy now. Like I've done a few Walmart hauls, but this is like, this is a legit one. It's not just like a quick five piecer, but anyway. <laughs> so I did get a swimsuit and I saw this one and I just thought it was so darling. Darling. I like do, that's such a weird choice of words for me, but I think it works so cute um 
I got this one in a 1x on the bottom. They were almost sold out of the suit. They only had like a 3x and a 1x and then that was it. So I really hope this was my size. Um, Because with swim bottoms, you never know. Sometimes they're like perfect, but sometimes they're like too tight. I don't know. Do you know what I'm saying? So I just love the striping. And there was actually one like this at Shein that I really, really wanted. But it was sold out. So I found this. And then I got the top. But they only had an extra large in this. So I'm a little bit worried, but I really, really wanted this suit. So I was like, we're just going to try it. And this was the only size that they had. And this top was $16.88. And the bottoms were $16.88 as well. So this is a little bit pricey for Walmart. I, this is honestly very close to what Target swimsuits are. So I'm really hoping this is good quality. And again, this is from the Time and True brand. So... Let's try this one on. Okay, so here's the swimsuit, and I think uh, this is cuter than I think what I was expecting. Like, I knew I was going to like it, but um, I just think it's such a cute swimsuit. Like, I love just the color block detailing. I like that it's just a simple kind of look. The thing is, though, it kind of fits a little bit strange. Like, I don't... <sighs> I don't know. It doesn't feel extremely supportive, I think is what I want to say. So the top, like it, it's not just a really, really supportive top, which is, I, I kind of think I was thinking that, but it is so cute if you're not doing like heavy duty swimming. And this is the back of the top. So it just kind of like clasps um, with a really thin back, but the bottoms are really, really nice. They're not super high waisted. So they sit right at my belly button. Um, but they're full coverage in the back, which has been kind of a like hard commodity to um, find this year because thong and cheeky bottoms are so in, which isn't bad, but you don't want that all the time. Well, at least I don't. So these bottoms are really, really nice. And I think it's like a versatile swimsuit. Um, you can kind of, I don't really know. It's cute. It's really cute. It is a little bit expensive. Do I think it's worth the price? Uh, not sure, but I do like it. So that is the swimsuit. Okay. And then next I got this pair of shorts and let me see what brand this is from. So these are also the no boundaries brand. I actually got a lot of no boundaries stuff just cause I feel like I'm drawn to that brand, but I saw these and I just thought they were so, so why do I keep wanting to say darling? Like what's going on with my brain? I usually want to say cute, but I'm saying darling, but so, so cute. Um, I love like the thick elastic band and they're just very basic, but they were only $5 and 98 cents. I honestly didn't even know they're that cheap. I was going to say they were 11, but such a steal for just a good pair of basic shorts. So I'm hoping that they're cute on and they're like a perfect loungy short. So I got these in an extra extra large, but um, yeah, so that is that pair of shorts. All right, so these shorts, they're good. Um, I definitely, I think I would size up for sure, but they, I don't know how to describe it. It's like, it's too tight down here for what I like as a like a comfortable, relaxing type of shorts, but they're so high waisted, like almost to the point where it's like too Hi, so I don't really know. Um, my butt isn't fully hanging out, but they are super, super cheeky. And for six bucks, definitely a good deal, but they're not my favorite lounge shorts of all time. They're so comfortable. It's literally just the fit doesn't like, it doesn't hit it for me, but yeah, they have pockets, which is nice. They're just, they're a nice, comfortable um, summer short option, just not my favorite ever. So the final thing, for some reason, I, I just did not realize this haul was so big, but I got this pair of shorts. And um, if you guys follow me on my Instagram, I'll put my Instagram here. So if you guys are curious and want to um, follow me over there, I actually just posted a picture um, in a pair of paper bag shorts that I got at Walmart last year. And you guys want bananas over them. I honestly, like, I just was not expecting that. And I tried to find them and they do not have that kind this year, which is so sad. But this is their paper bag short this year, which I'm not sure if I like it more or less um, than the style they had last year. But this one has a belt with it. So this is very similar, the whole ruching with the um, button. 
but it comes with a belt which you guys can take off I guess if you don't like that but I did get this really adorable acid wash print um they had completely plain ones if you guys just wanted a plain denim but I just thought these were so so fun so I'm really hoping these are cute they have like nice pockets on the back and I got these in an extra extra large it says that they are in ultra high rise so yes these look like they're gonna be high yeah. and these were $11.98 so it also says these are in a 19 as well which is what I got um the size shorts in but yeah that's the last thing so let's try all of the stuff on okay so here are the acid wash shorts these are no joke super high-waisted um which I don't hate where they sit but I don't know it's not like my it's I don't know um, I just think I like last year's version of the paperback short a little bit better, but they are very, very similar. Like the way they fit down here is similar. Um, other than the belt, which I don't hate the belt. I think the belt is like a really cute kind of, um, you know, I don't know, add in, <laughs> but detail, I don't know what I'm saying. Um, they do have pockets, which is really nice, really comfortable pockets. They're so, so comfortable. Just not like my favorite shorts ever, but also maybe with like a white um, tank top would be a lot cuter. Um, and then this is the back. So you have pockets back here, which is nice. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I think I'd like them more if they were just like a plain um, color. Now that I'm seeing this, I thought I would love this print, but I just don't think I'm like I'm crazy about it to be honest. But so really cute. Um, yeah, I don't know. You guys will have to let me know. Let me know about oh, what you think on this haul. It's always different when I watch the footage back, but. Okay, guys, so that is everything that I got from Walmart. This was, like I said, the biggest Walmart haul that I've done, and I definitely think there were some hits and misses. Not everything was absolutely amazing, but I did find some gems, and that's kind of how it goes with Walmart. So let me know your favorite piece down below, and I love y'all, and I'll see you in the next one.